Well, I think a, an open to the public town hall from the congressman in the neighboring district is a great public service because, let's face it, Anchor Patrick has not been known for being forthcoming with the public and having open town hall meetings to talk about the, the issues that matter to the country. So since she won't, I've asked the neighboring congressman to do so. And so I think that's going to be really valuable to the, to the folks, especially to talk about what's really in the latest bailout bill that they voted just on Tuesday that Anchor Badger voted for. Um, Congressman Franks also is very pivotal right now in national defense, and he's got a new idea, a new proposal about how to put border security into um, national defense, and he's got a bill to do exactly that, which I think may be just the thing that, that gets us to, to get the federal government to to be forced to defend the borders. So we'll talk about national national defense and border security, and we'll talk about what's going on with all these bailouts in Washington. And I think it'll be real informative, and, and folks will get a lot of questions answered. He is rated by the National Journal as the number one most conservative member of Congress. And that's not just fiscal, but right down the line. Will there be a time for question and answers? Oh, absolutely. The, the bulk of the time will be question and answers, because that's the important part. So are you kind of sponsoring this event? It, it, it will be, uh, yeah, Sydney Hay for Congress event, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But really, I'm, I'm not I'm kind of really just try, trying to provide it for a public service, because people aren't getting, as I'm, as I'm out there campaigning, one of the things is huge frustration that I hear constantly is why haven't we have to have these town halls? We have these telephone town halls where the calls are screened and only softball questions. And there's a lot of people that are scared to death of what's happening in the economy and the jobs and, and their own personal uh, economic future that people feel are, are at risk. So I just think this will be a really good opportunity for folks to, to be able to vent some of those concerns and questions and get some straight answers from someone who is known for giving straight answers.